जय हिंद टू ऑल गुड इवनिंग ऑल्सो टूडे आई एम गोइंग टू स्टार्ट क्लास इलेवेंथ बायोलॉजी सम स्टूडेंट्स वे आर आस्किंग टू गिव सम मटेरियल ऑफ बायोलॉजी ऑफ क्लास इलेवेंथ सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल लेट अस नो विच बुक वी हैव टू फॉलो एंड वॉट वी हैव टू डू इन दिस क्लास रिगार्डिंग द बायोलॉजी सब्जेक्ट it's the living subject you will read what you are uh, how you behave why you behave means in biology you are going to read yourself how uh, your body you as a organization means it's a according to my views this is a very living subject okay and the uh, biology opens a very enlarged field in the field of career also like you neat is only not the last destination for biology subject for uh, by taking biology you can do biotechnology genetic engineering agri tech food technology uh, by food technologies you can be you can get jobs in various uh, companies to check the food qualities pharmaceutical uh, agencies also I mean various large enormous field is opened by taking after uh, choosing the subject biology in class uh, 11 and 12 means plus 2 level okay at the in the kendriya vidyalaya we follow the book ncrt subject we follow the book of ncrt in the subject biology so i as a teacher of kendriya vidyalaya follows totally ncrt book in 11th and 12th also it's a mother of uh, or the you can say that it's a it has a cumulative uh, uh, very concise book thin also but the each and every line of this book has a definite knowledge a definite statement and every line will lead you a progressive and advanced knowledge so uh, starting the class with this book ncrt book i will follow the ncrt book in both 11th and 12th in 11th you we have to study we have to study the uh, unit unit 1 that is 1 2 3 four, 5 units we have to study in class 11th and total 22 chapters okay the first unit is diversity in the living world pehla jo unit hai hamara wo diversity in living world hai okay in this unit we have to study four chapters the living world biological classification plant kingdom and animal kingdom in the living world we will know about the fascinating world of the living its character its taxonomical groups and taxonomical aids means the um, uh, where we can uh, get the help of uh, uh, to recognize or to get the source of the knowledge of the living world that is taxonomical aids in the second pre chapter biological classification where these living animals are classified third chapter is devoted to all plant kingdom from algae to angiosperms and the fourth chapter is devoted to uh, animal kingdom that is uh it's how uh, first of all the chapter will be started by how it is classified then the basic characteristics of classification then uh, whole classification how many uh, kingdom and five uh, how many phylum it is divided and whole phylum with examples and their own characteristics so in this uh, slide we will uh, study we will start the chapter 1 that is the living world पहला हमारा इलेवेंथ क्लास का चैप्टर है द लिविंग वर्ल्ड ओके इन द लिविंग वर्ल्ड व्हाट वी विल स्टडी इज इन द लिविंग वर्ल्ड 
what we will study in the first para it is given uh, it is uh, taught about the chapter the lines are uh, we you after studying these lines we will this is this will give the general idea of the living world the uh, the chapter starts with a line that how wonderful is the living world means it is make you and uh, make you think that how wonderful this living world is how amazing fascinating this living world is which has a wide range of varieties it starts from unicellular microscopic bacteria and ends to a uh, uh, gigantic plant kingdom uh, gymnosperms group of plants large trees and uh, enormous god uh, enormous mammals also large mammals like uh, whale beautiful uh, creatures also so all the general beautiness of the living world is given in this first para how you have to study the ncert book is that you you must have ncert book first if you uh, start studying in class 12 biology first of all buy ncert book or if it is not available then download it, it from ncert app okay and then uh, you always keep studying the ncert book with a pencil in your hand okay read line by line line by line aapko padhna hai ek ek words pe dhyan dena hai kyunki ncert book jo itni patli dikh rahi hai iske ek ek line mein aapka jo knowledge hai wo ek step aage badhta hai so ek line bhi aapse chutega to iska matlab wo knowledge ka gap ho jayega aapke learning mein theek hai एक एक लाइन को पढ़ना है और उसके बाद जो इंपॉर्टेंट लाइन है कंक्लूडिंग लाइन है उस लाइन को अंडरलाइन करना है तो हम लोग इसी तरह एनसीआरटी बुक को पढ़ना स्टार्ट करेंगे हर एक स्टूडेंट के बाद पास एनसीआरटी बुक होगी पेंसिल होगा और एक एक वर्ड हम लोग पढ़ेंगे रीडिंग डालेंगे बच्चों की तरह और जो कंक्लूडिंग लाइन होगा उसको अंडरलाइन करेंगे ओके वी विल स्टार्ट our syllabus with the chapter 1 and the chapter is living world and this is the introduction how you get fascinating about the world of the living okay in the next slide we will uh, i will teach you what are the living characters which make it different from the non living okay so start your class with biology with biology book ncert and um, uh, reading habit along with me okay wish you best and choose balaji to live your life uh, understanding yourself